Good evening, everyone, and happy holidays. We have got some ooh, fabulous entertainment in store today. We have music, we have dancing, we have special guests from far and wide. And now, put your hands together for Disney Holidays in Hollywood. to be co-hosting this magical musical show for all of you tonight. Bonjour! Yes, tis moi! <laughs> the greatest gift of all this holiday season. It must be such an honor for all of you to have moi here tonight. Uh, uh, Piggy, I said the honor was ours. Huh? Oh, <laughs> right. I suppose it is an honor for you and the rest of the cast, too. Well, look at me! I'm just honoring everyone here with my presence tonight. But I guess that's the spirit of the holidays, isn't it? Uh, sure, uh, let's go with that. Uh, but when I think about what the holidays mean to me, it's sharing the magic of the season with the ones we love most. Aww, and that's why you're here with more tonight, isn't it, Kami? <laughs> well, uh, you see, uh, <clears throat> we're here because, uh, because we were both invited. Uh, yes, and because there's no better place to spend the holiday season than Walt Disney World! Sure, dear. Well, when I think of 
think about what Christmas means to me, I think about presents. Really? <laughs> Just presents? Are there so much more to the holiday season than gifts? Isn't there? Well, sure. But come on! We're literally standing in a pile of presents, clothes, shoes, and toys for all the little piggies and froggies out there who dream of being just like you and Toyland, Toyland, everyone's Christmas joy. I really think that you're missing out on the best parts of the holidays. Sure, this is the season of giving. Ah, the season of giving me gifts. Pretty sure that's receiving. But what I'm trying to say is that some gifts don't come in boxes and pretty paper. That's a great point, Carmen. And maybe all those children out there are looking for the kind of gifts that live inside here. Yeah, like Kermit's warm heart, generosity, or your... Your bold sense of self-confidence, Miss Piggy. Oh, <laughs> thank you so much for noticing. Wait, who are you again? Uh, these are just a couple of friends who've come to help us put on a great show this evening. Come on, everybody. Toyland, Toyland, fill up your hearts with Joyland. We hope the season spirit brings you everything you need. Kermit the Frog and Miss Piggy, everyone. Whoa, whoa, hold it, Bob. Where do you think you're taking us? Oh, <laughs> well, we have to make sure these presents make it home in time for Christmas. Yeah, that makes sense, but uh, we're kind of in the middle of a production here. Oh, I don't make the rules. I'm just the talent. Wait, you are the talent? Yes, Piggy, this is... Kiana. And... Bobby. And there are fellow co-hosts for this evening. A fellow what? How many hosts does this show need? How big is your trailer? Your student come with a jacuzzi did it because I explicitly asked for one and I did not get one. We'll be back, folks. Uh, uh probably. Okay, come on, Piggy. We better start digging our way out of here. You did? Oh, rock! <laughs> Let's see, what do we got here? And we are out. We're at commercial, folks. <laughs> This program is brought to you by Goofy's Candy Company, your one-stop shop for stocking stuffers this holiday season. Have you ever had one of those days? Good evening, everyone. We are so glad that you have decided to join us for our live studio audience for our holiday TV special. Yes, we are. You know, we just heard Kermit the Frog and Miss Piggy talk about what the holidays mean to them. And to be honest, I think Miss Piggy has a point about those presents. So, in the spirit of giving, I would like to now give you all the gift of Stand-up comedy. <laughs> no, no, no. We don't have that kind of time. It's not that long of a commercial. <laughs> We're back in four, three, two. Welcome back, everyone. You know, when I was growing up, my family moved around a lot. So we spent Christmas in different places all over the country. Every year, it was somewhere new. New York. Uh, Chicago? Uh, New Orleans? New Orleans? My grandma, she grew up in New Orleans. She used to tell me all sorts of amazing stories about Christmas time down there. The bonfires, the smell of Creole food wafting out of every restaurant. Ooh, she said the best Revion dinner in all of New Orleans was at Tiana's, Tiana's Palace. Palace! Oh, she's so right. That place has the best beignets, and it's such a party at Christmas time. Ooh, I could just imagine. Hello, Hi, Welcome to Tiana's Palace. Now, the place looks a little different than usual, but that's because we're all dressed up for the holidays. And we're just around the corner, and oh, I'm so excited. It's my favorite time of year. And if you don't mind, I would love to tell you a little bit about what it means to me. From the start to night of winter, taking through the city lights, I'm sending my season's greetings out to all the ones that twinkle bright. Gather up the family, and I will make it through the fields like home.
You're so fun. If I had to pick just one thing though, my very favorite part of the holiday season is making everyone's favorite treats. Naveen, Mama, Lottie Lewis, and Santa, of course. There's nothing like the smell of warm cookies filling the air. I always make them for the frosted sugar ones my daddy used to love, and the spicy ginger snaps, and those special pecan friendlies you can always get down in New Orleans. You know, every year when I was just a little girl, my daddy taught me each and every one of those recipes. We spent all day baking together, and then he'd let me wait up and stay for Santa. I always fell asleep before he got there, of course. But you know, every year, I got just what I needed. <laughs> Stage. Well, that just won't do. I didn't have any time to accessorize between numbers, and I refuse to be upstaged. I could never upstage you, Piggy. Listen, how about I make it up to you by getting you a churro and a spirit jersey after the show? Uh, having a giant pretzel and you got a deal. Done. Now we're talking. Aren't they just the best? As a special treat to all of you in our live studio audience, please give it up for our house band, the Jolly Eight! Gosh, I 
love the snow. Just makes you want to run outside and look for a Christmas tree. Say, I know. I'll go out right now and get the best tree I can find and take it over to surprise Minnie. I know she doesn't have one yet, and, well, she loves to decorate for Christmas. Oh, <laughs> I can't wait to see the look in her face. Oh, this weather just makes you want to cozy up inside and start decorating for the holidays. Hmm, I know. I bet I can put up all these decorations before Mickey gets here and surprise him with a whole house full of Christmas cheer. Oh, he's going to love it. <laughs> Time to find ourselves a Christmas tree. holiday TV special with all of you is a gift I will always cherish. <laughs> oh yeah, I know what you mean. We're making memories that we'll never forget. And we're back in four, three, two. This time of year, the greatest gift you can give is something you won't find on a shelf. It's something we find in each other. Let's be honest, the world we live in can be a little more than chilly, but the belief that better days are coming that's what counts, because the greatest gift of all is hope.
Now that's what the holidays mean to me. Peace and warmth. Yeah, oh, friends, family, our traditions. Ooh, singing our favorite songs? Let's do it! <laughs> Great time here at 50 Holidays in Hollywood!